What's going on, everybody? I'm Tank, and this is another episode of Roadie Reactions. In today's reaction video, I am gonna be returning to our favorite German power metal band, Blind Guardian. And the only reason I didn't get there sooner is because I let you guys on Patreon vote on it, and you picked Sabaton first, so this one came a few days later, I hope you don't mind, but I think we're in for a treat. The song that I've chose to do today was easily the most recommended that all of you told me to check out, and it's a live performance, so that means I'm gonna see a bunch of gear, it's gonna be fun, and we'll dive right in. Today, I am gonna be reacting to Blind Guardian with a live version of Mirror Mirror. Let's go. I mean, is Hanzi even gonna have to sing? God. That's just so cool, man. I love to see that. Like, as a roadie on the road, there are moments in the live show where you can hear the crowd building up. And when that crowd can take over that loud, to where the singer just gives up and holds the mic up. I mean, that's amazing. That's awesome. Um, this is fantastic again, man. This is only my third Blind Guardian song, but took me a minute to get some of the time changes they were doing uh, just to get my head banging down, but I think I got it. Um, let's lose this. I, I don't need it. I already know that. Um, we'll get into gear the next time I pause. I just want to keep enjoying this. Oh, that guitar lead is sick. I like that keyboard part in the back, too. Before this chorus, the one thing I've noticed about this band more than any other power metal band or really metal band that I really listen to is one of their guitar players, I believe Andre, if I'm not mistaken, is just ripping leads the whole time. Like, not necessarily solos, but really cool lead uh, parts. And it's just really cool. Like, um, it just stands out a ton and I love it. Um, this is fantastic, man. Um, 
I'm kind of catching the lyrics here and there, and I'm sure I'll answer my own question as I always do when I edit these videos, but I know they had a Lord of the Rings album. Is Mirror Mirror from that album? Um, I'm guessing it is. Gear-wise, stage right guitar player, I believe that's Andre. He is playing an Ibanez. It looks like an RG series, but I'm pretty sure it's a Frankenstein guitar. And what I mean by that is it's a fully custom shop guitar. That is not a guitar that they sell that you're going to be able to buy. It's a custom guitar, every piece of it. Stage left, I believe his name is Marcus. I try and do my research after I hear him for the first time. I believe it's Marcus. Looks like he's playing a Gibson Flying V. Actually, I know it's a Flying V. I'm assuming it's a Gibson. I haven't seen the headstock. Could be another Frankenstein guitar that's just all modded. Um, the pick guard on the top of it, and the pick guard is kind of the shinier part you're seeing. Um, that looks like that was changed out because usually those Flying Vs are a solid color, like black and white or a white pickguard on a natural finished body. Um, looked like he had different pickups in there too, so super rad. Let's get into this chorus and listen to the crowd. Still going with the leads. Bass player is playing a Fender Jazz bass. Unreal. So, for those of you that follow this channel, you know that this is only the second time I've reacted to Blind Garden. So, I, Blind Garden, Guardian. So, I don't know terribly much about the band other than what I've kind of looked up after listening the first time. Um, this guitarist. I believe it's Andre that's playing the leads. I'm go I've got to guess that he's got to be up there, like in the talks of like really notable, just awesome guitar players in this scene. And I mean, like I said, leads the whole time, even when he's soloing is just phenomenal. I got to imagine he's got to be in the talks of some of the better guitarists in the power metal scene. And um, it's just impressive, man. Like I really really like this band a lot haven't got a look at the drums at all but if i remember right from the bard song in the valhalla video i did um he was playing minor cymbals which makes sense german company and i believe it was tama drums if i'm wrong i'll correct myself let's finish this off
I didn't think I was going to pause again, but I felt like I was leaving the keyboard player out. I haven't seen what model keyboard playing or keyboard he's playing, but it looks like a Yamaha. Oh, it's a blast. All right, let's go talk about it. Well, we can officially add Blind Guardian to the list of bands I need to go see live once all this quarantine stuff is over because I officially love this band. I did after the first time I reacted to him, but man, every chorus I've heard so far is just so powerful. And the band is impressive as hell, man. Like. I just love how much lead work is going on, how much intricate stuff is happening. It's not just generic, boring sound. Like, there's always something going on that's catching your ear, whether it's a guitar lead or the keyboardist doing something cool. Because there was a lot of cool keyboard parts in there too, but I thoroughly enjoyed that. We got to do Blind Guardian again sooner than the last time because I think this was like a month span in between the two, but this is great. It's fantastic. I'm starting to really love power metal, and I really didn't when I was younger. Um, thank you, guys. This was a great video to go to next, and I appreciate it. If you're new here, feel free to click subscribe. Turn your alerts on because I drop new videos almost daily. You'll be alerted the second they come out. And if you liked the video, I would greatly appreciate it if you would click like. If you disliked it, go ahead and dislike it. Totally fine. I'm also on a ton of social media, Instagram, Twitter, YouTube, Twitch, Discord. I'll put the link to my Discord server in the description below. There's a lot of us that hang out and chat on there and it's super fun. And my handle on all of social media is at Tank the Tech. Thank you so much once again for watching and I will be back very soon with another episode of Roadie Reactions.